What you doing now, Dave? I'm trying to wreck the dryer. <laughs> Why do you want to wreck the dryer? That way we don't have to do laundry. Oh. <laughs> nah, the dryer gave it up, and it's this little thermostat right here is what gave it up. So I have to test the thermostat, and, and then I got to try to remember how to put all this back together. We're Dave and Karen from Watts on Wheels, and we sold our sticks and bricks to RV full-time now that we are retired. We travel with our heavy-duty truck Leroy, our two k motorcycles, our DRV Dixie, and our smart car Zippy. Don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell to be notified when we post a new video. We have an Ariston Splendide TVM 63X. And now it's just a pile of garbage. So what's the next thing you're going to do? Uh, I'm going to try to take this cover off of this drum to reset all the stuff back in there and then put the cover back on it. What do you got to reset? Well, you see how it came out of the, the seal came out uh -uh. and it came disconnected from the pipe too. So Oh man. It would be a lot easier to fix that without this cover on it. I see. All the wires are so short that so that one goes on a switch. This one goes on that switch. The upper part of the switch. This one goes on this switch. You filming this? So I know which one's which. Kinda, your hand's kinda in the way. But Black goes on the top, and the orange goes on the bottom. Okay. You like to get it off. But then we're all tied up here with zip ties. Let me get you some scissors. Yeah. found you can't do load after load after load in this dryer because it just overheats. That's weird that that came out of there. Like this. Oh, I see. Oh, man. There you go. There it is. Let me get you a Band-Aid. You're going to need more than a Band-Aid. Well, if you ain't bleeding, mm -hmm. you ain't working. That's how it goes. That's a freaking mess. It all fall like fall apart when you took it off top it, off or yeah. something. Yeah, it did. Fell apart again. Is that an exhaust tube? That's what? Exhaust tube? Yeah. This is going to be a real trick. How do I make that thing stay in there? Got to go to the left about a half an inch. <clears throat> or I can try to push that over for you. Is the back hooked up to the drum in here? Is the back of the tube hooked yeah. up? Yeah, back of the tube hooked up. Oh shit! Be oh, here. it just came off again. Yeah. Let's try this. Let me get the drum back together. Okay. And I won't go for that. You got, are there screws for that? or is No. Oh, there you go. Is that uh, it? Yeah. No.
Have your drums way off. I know. Okay. Want me to move that door? <laughs> yeah. you can't you can't like it's like you can't do both at the same time. No. I think you were right before you got to get the drum in place and then get the tube on. There's a whole lot more of them. Test them. One meter. And you're just putting it on the each end of that? Right. That tells me that oh, it's okay. still making connection. Get the power off on this thing? Yeah. Take one lead off. That one's good. That one's good. Test the original one you thought you had to replace? Yeah. That's that one, huh? I'm going to hold on to that bracket for a little bit. That one's dead. Nothing on the ohmmeter. That is the appropriate thermostat, though. Yeah, this is the one that went bad. Okay. Well, at least you guessed it. One out of three, you guessed the right one. <laughs> like you want to put tape around it and mm -hmm. shove it in there. Yeah. You're just trying to give it a little thickness to it or? Yeah. So see if that'll work. plug into something because I got orange red and white white goes to here it has to it's part of the power so this orange is just a loop though you couldn't do that Ain't right if you don't have leftover parts. Oh. You still got to replace the thing, don't you? Yeah. Got it. I'm taking this to be the switch for the door. And this is a red lead. This is a black lead. 
and this is the orange lead so that's how I got them arranged down there and then for this the on off switch orange and white the orange one yep. comes up from there and then it's just the white we'll find out here in a minute how he did How much did that thing cost us? Can I see it? There it is. That just snaps on. Right there. Now this. Right there. Orange is on the bottom and white's on the top. Let's see how this goes. Nope. Something not wired right. It just went pop? Yep. What you doing now? Let's just take it apart and see what happened. Those two are right, we know those two are right. My big fat hand. What did you do different? Nothing, I don't think. Uh, just a better connection, maybe? Door's not closed. Oh. Hallelujah, brothers and sisters. So, do you recommend other people do this? It just reverses on its own. Uh, sure, they could try it. <laughs> How many beers is this one, Dave? This is going to be a beer, a couple shots, More and a new hand. I tell ya, it might be tough, but I've never seen you not fix something, have we? Have you? Do you remember? Well, I've never thrown the towel in. <laughs> I might throw it away, but I'll never throw it in. I thought we were going to have to call the guy. Never have to call. Why call the guy? You thought you were going to have to call the guy for a little while there. I thought I was going to have to call the guy. Did you reverse any of the wires you put together? You just, no, went I just went through everything again. Just make sure that it was connected good. And yeah, maybe one just wasn't connected good and it was sparking or arcing or something. Dave, you amaze me. I amaze myself. You the man. Who the man? You the man. You the man. Here, let me get Ouch. you a beer. So, Dave, it seemed like you had to do an awful lot of work just to replace the thermostat. Well, actually, I didn't have to do that much work. I just felt like screwing around for the day. No. 
Now I did a lot extra that I didn't have to do. Actually all you have to do to replace that one thermostat is there's two screws in the back, you undo those and the top pops off. You can just reach down in there and change the thermostat. But when I took the pop the top off and everything and I moved it around a little bit, the tube underneath the exhaust tube, you heard it go dunk, fell off on the ground. So that started my whole nightmare. Then you just had a domino where the, then, the yeah. drum came off. Drum or... front came off, this fell off, that fell off. I was ready to call the guy. But you didn't. I did. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below, even if it's just to say hi. Don't forget to subscribe.